Kenny and Sandra, we're all here today to celebrate, to bless, and support this amazing love that you've found in one another. We are so honored and delighted to be here for you in this beautiful place. Every good love story has a beginning, and today we celebrate yours and how it began all the way back in 2014 when you made a fateful connection in high school photography class. Kenny quickly came to admire Sandra's fun and friendly nature, and being a year ahead in school, he had a car, and he always had a pack of gum on him, so they quickly became friends and eventually fell in love. Today, almost eight years later, we celebrate all the joy, fun, and laughter that you've shared in your journey so far. You've achieved so many milestones together, just to name a few. Graduating from high school, starting your careers, moving in and building a home together, keeping your love alive and strong during a global pandemic, and being the ventures that you are, you've traveled to 16 of the 63 national parks together so far. But back to milestones, we celebrate that very special moment in August of 2021, when at Two Medicine Lake and Glacier National Park, Kenny surprised Sandra by proposing and made her his bride-to-be. We didn't wake up this morning thinking we're perfect people. None of us are. But I do love what the scriptures do tell us. It says that we know love comes from God because God, in his essence, is love. It goes on to say that every good and perfect gift comes to us from God. Like I said before, we're not perfect people. But Kenny and Sandra, as we gather here in this place and we look at you and celebrate you and your story, it's so abundantly clear what a perfect gift you are to each other. So today, we as your family and friends send all of our love, our blessing, and support for a life well-lived and well-loved as husband and wife. Sandra, my adventure partner and best friend, I promise forever today with you. You are the person that can light up a room and see the best in anyone. You're the most passionate and strong-minded person I know. I love you for that. I knew from the moment we met in photography class that we would be partners for a while, and now a while is forever. Today marks a strong 2,379 days of our relationship, and now we can keep growing that number as a married couple. Today I vow to you that I will always be there for you. I vow to take you into bed at 8 p.m. with more blankets and a glass of water. I vow to cherish and respect you. I promise to love you no matter what. Kenny, my high school sweetheart, my best friend, and my soon-to-be husband. I love you unconditionally and without hesitation, which is why today I am choosing to spend the rest of my life with you. I can't say I knew it was you from the start because I didn't, but I did know you were the one when I saw you playing with my brothers and finally getting along. Fixing my parents' cars numerous times, or just traveling around the world with me, whether it was planned or just a spontaneous trip I decided I wanted to take. I knew from the day you showed up at every game I cheered at, or games my brothers were playing in, or events my sister was singing at, you showed up, and from those days on, I knew you were the one. You have been so sweet and supportive to not only me, but my huge, loving, little bit crazy family, you always show up for the people you care about and always do your best to help people around you. You have such a big heart and I love you for that. You are truly my best friend and I am so happy we are on the same team together to go through this crazy life. You are the love of my life and I cannot imagine living without you. You make me unbelievably proud and I promise to make you proud as your wife. I vow to listen to you, learn from you. I vow to laugh and cry with you. I vow to value and accept our differences just as much as our similarities. I vow to put all my efforts into strengthening our marriage. I vow to love you on our good days, bad days, rain or shine. I vow to always love you, and I vow to try not to make as many messes in our new home together. Sonner and Kenny, as you start your married life together, I want you to know the love and respect that each of you have and the differences you've had over the years have been one of my favorite things about you. Don't forget to continue to love each other the same way. I'm so proud of you both and have no doubt that your adventures are just beginning and I wish that both of you 
have nothing but happiness. And even though you are both very independent, remember to lean on your family because you mean the world to us. Thank you.